Hey y'all. Don't mind me in my pajamas. At 4.36 p.m. Because we're about to have a hurricane blow through. I just got everything all cleaned up and back like I wanted it for my outdoor space. And now look at it. Ooh. Look y'all. Had to take everything down. Ugh. Boo. Oh Lord. Trees are starting to blow. I'm really mostly worried. All those trees in my neighbor's yard. Those trees worry me because they're so tall. And they can just fall this way. I am praying nothing falls this way. Also, see that? This is a big old pile of Halloween decorations because I had to take everything out of the yard so that it would not get blown all around by the hurricane. So I might put it back out. I don't know, we'll see. So I totally plan to do an entire house Halloween tour and show you all my cute little decorations, but life got in the way and <laughs> it took me way longer to decorate than I anticipated it taking because I just was busy and I've mentioned that in previous videos like work got crazy and so I was away from home that's one of my Halloween decorations so I was away from home multiple nights in a row multiple weeks in a row and I was just having to do it little by little so I didn't do like one big video of me putting it all together because that was just like little bites at a time. But it is all together. We have been enjoying it every night. It is so fun in here. And I'm just gonna show it to you without it being all fancy. I'm just gonna show you what I did. All right, this is our entryway. So fun when you walk in the door and you get to see all this. Lots of spider webs and lights and skeletons i love skeletons we got some spiders and these cute little hand candle holders that i got from the dollar tree and look at that fun skeleton got my raven and a spider i got these candlesticks at the dollar tree and i love them they're so much fun and i've got some spider webs up on my light there as well so you walk in, that's the first thing you see. And there's our living room area. And over here, my dining area. I always love to hang spider webs from this light because it's just perfect for it. See my little cat over there? Meow. And then we've got some fun black and purple eyeball flowers. <laughs> Got some cute little containers because I'm gonna cook all the cute Halloween fun treats. And that's where they're gonna go in this basket here. You got this cute little stand from Walmart. Got another cute little stand, that's a new one this year. My little chargers. Got cute purple plates too for us to eat on. Oops, I need to take that tag off. <laughs> another stand and my cute cups from last year. Got them at the Dollar Tree. There's Scully. He always makes an appearance in his pet rat. We haven't named him yet. Thought that was kind of fun this year, putting these eyeballs on the napkins. Another cute little container. And our little skull guys. More skulls. Need to get some tea lights for our little hands there. We've got spiders in the web. It is just fun, 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 fun. And over here, got my light <laughs> with a rat and more light. I love turning all these lights on, especially at night. Let's see, this dude is not on, let's see. There we go. Yay. I'll have to turn out all the lights and show you. And here's our mirror. Got a fun skull decal there. And then over here at our china cabinet, 
Got the keep out sign back there and he makes an appearance every year. Cute little skull with his bow tie. Got a little skull in there too. And this dude, <laughs> just a mask stuck into a picture, but he's so fun. Another skull. And my cat, meow. Over here, on our little sofa table is our candy dish. And y'all cannot keep this full. My kids have enjoyed the candy dish. We've got all kinds of fun things on the table. This little garland came from the Dollar Tree. And look, he's missing a leg, but it doesn't matter. He's a skeleton. He can be with one leg. Fun down there. These cool purple skulls that I got from Target this year. And more of those candlesticks. I already had the, or the candles. I already had the candlesticks. So lots of fun. There's a spider just hanging out. Another spider. Over here in the living area, I always put these, oop. Look at that, y'all. <laughs> this is my daughter's favorite Halloween decoration. Don't you dare <laughs> hang up. Come with me. He's funny. All right, so I don't do too, too much in the living room. Got a couple cute little things here. And there's my fireplace. That might be my favorite thing. We've got a few things on the bookcase over here. Another skull. And a cute little book set. Love this little, it's like raven wings or something. And some Reese's bars and a cute little pumpkin. That phone keeps ringing. Got our extra large spiders. And our little band. <laughs> Got my cat up there. He always finds his way onto the top shelf. And then little things. I got so much noise animated stuff, y'all, or motion animated stuff. This dude, he makes me happy. Let's see if he'll get going. <laughs> How fun is that? I love him. <laughs> All right. So then, another spider. This is also new this year, this cool little skull thing, like stack skulls with lights that look really neat at night. Another spider. And over here in our keeping room, we've got the skeleton dog over here by the dog food. And we've got another skeleton, another one of those purple ones, another spider. This is so cool. It's like a, it's hard to see it in the camera. You can see it a little bit, but it's a fortune teller ball. More of this black net. And then got a couple cute little things like another pumpkin and a snake and a spider. And this jar of caramel candy corn. And y'all, I didn't know how much I liked can caramel candy corn until this year. I really like it and I can't stop eating it. Got a little spider here on our bookshelf. And here is my buffet. So let's see. You can get the whole full view. We've got a spider web hanging up here. And I hung this little garland with cute little spiders and these cute flower things. And it's just kind of a smorgasbord of stuff on this table. We've got those skull hands and spiders and trees and Yogi has a spider on his head. We've got all kinds of fun stuff. And y'all, we took those um, bouncy ball eyes <laughs> and we stuck them in the skeletons because it's fun. So yeah, cute little garland here and some more of that netting. I literally just start putting stuff out and tweaking as I go. I never have a whole plan in mind, like what it's going to look like. I just start doing stuff until I like it. 
And this guy's fun. Let's see if I can make him. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Also have some skeletons hanging. So yeah. Oh wait, we got a couple more things, or one more thing. Really just a couple more. This cute little sign that I got in my boo box. The kids got in their boo box, I should say. And this little guy who always lives right above the stove. Every year, he takes his place above the stove. So that's it, y'all. That is what Halloween is looking like inside our house. Even though this hurricane is making it where you can't enjoy the fun stuff outside, we're making it super festive inside. So here's night time. It's fun to curl up in here. And watch a fun Halloween movie. <laughs> I'm gonna have to turn that off. So right now, six o'clock, and we're just waiting for this storm to pass. So I'm gonna get those clothes folded and probably go to bed early. Hopefully, this, it's supposed to be fast moving. Hopefully, it will move fast, get out of here, and let us go to bed and enjoy some movies and not have to worry about power outages and down trees. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give me a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. And check me out on Instagram where I share more of my homeschool journey. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!